Good morning. Welcome to Camlook, your daily dose of the Cincinnati Art Museum. At 10 o'clock each weekday, a staff member or volunteer will be here to share an object from our collection. So join us for each new conversation. My name is Betty and I'm a museum docent. Well, here we are at the beginning of wedding season and in a year where we expect a bumper crop of couples tying the knot. So I thought this would be a great time to share an object from our collection, a silver pitcher that started its journey as a wedding gift from father to daughter. This is the Rebecca at the Well pitcher, produced by Gorham and Company in 1852. That was the same year John Gorham assured his company's success by investing in equipment to use a steam press to stamp silver. Gorham, based in Providence, Rhode Island, became the largest silver company in the world. Look at the detail work on this picture. It is a Rococo revival design with both repoussé and chase decoration and a grape stock handle and spout. With repoussé, the silversmith hammers the metal from the back using tools to create a raised design on the front. With chasing, the design is created by hammering a blunt tool against the surface. Gorham believed this was an excellent example of their advanced silversmithing skills, so they included it in an 1852 ad. Can you see it in the very middle of the top drawing? A Cincinnatian who wanted to buy this picture might have purchased it in Gorham's Providence shop through a traveling salesman or from a local Cincinnati retail shop like Doomy and Company. This picture was purchased by a Cincinnati banker named Louis Whiteman for the 1854 wedding of his daughter, Louisa Whiteman Carson. The proud father must have loved the design, so ripe for a new bride. It is Rebecca at the well from the Hebrew scriptures. In this story from Genesis 24, Rebecca is revealed as Isaac's future wife when she draws water from a well. And just like the biblical Rebecca, the bride Louisa could always use her father's gift to pour water for her guest. We know that Gorham kept a design library with books, models, and drawings across cultures to be design inspirations. In this case, the designer probably created the body of the silver pitcher based on a print from an original 1833 Oris Ferney painting called Rebecca at the Fountain. Now, most couples today would never expect such a splendid gift. So my question for you is this. Will you be going to a wedding this summer? What's your favorite wedding gift to give a couple? Add your thoughts in the chat below.